Hello, Serial Nation. I'm Papa Swag. And I'm Ben. And together we are... Serial United. And we want to welcome you to our channel because on this channel... We talk about cereal and anything related to cereal. And so, Ben, I'm excited for another um, new cereal we're trying today. One of your favorites because... Well, I don't know if it's your favorite cereal, but I do know you're a big fan of Pop-Tart. Oh, I'm a huge fan of Pop-Tarts. And brown sugar cinnamon is the best flavored Pop Tart. Let me correct you, it's frosted brown sugar cinnamon. Oh, yeah, because there is unfrosted. I don't know why they made that. What? I'm not even going to go there. We're not even going there today. Well, I'm looking forward to it. I really don't have any. Well, we'll see. Maybe I have a story. Maybe I don't about Pop Tarts. Yeah. Do you got any stories? I mean, I used to eat them every day for breakfast, but that's all I got from my story. Nothing crazy about the Pop Tarts. Why do you eat them for breakfast? Did you eat them for dinner? Uh, I used to eat them for like snacks, but never for dinner. Okay. Maybe once. I don't know, maybe a Sunday night. Well, let's go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> Sunday nights and cereal. Maybe you want to talk about that. Let me open up the box. All right, Ben, I'm smell the cereal. Oh, man, this smells like Pop-Tarts. I can smell from here. Yeah, actually, it's a good... Oh, you're, you're going to like it. Look at you. That's a lot. Let me show you real close up. That's in there. That's like a nice little square. And here's a, you know, a nice bowl, light and fat. I'm wondering if there's filling in there. Let's take a bite and see. Yeah. Afterwards? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yep, let's go. Let's pour the milk and continue on your story on Sunday nights and cereal. Okay, my Sunday nights in cereal. Alright, how do I want to do this? Here's the milk. Oh, get the milk. Okay, so. Wow, I about spilled it everywhere. Alright, so growing up, Sunday nights. So, for some reason, every other day of the week, we always had dinner. Monday, Tuesday, we were always, had, we were always fed. Every other day or every day? Every day, except for Sunday. Oh, okay. Sunday, we would go to church, and then we would probably normally, we'd normally eat out for, for lunch. However, when Sunday night rolled around and we asked for dinner, they always said, I don't know, nothing, bowl of cereal, whatever. So it became this big thing in, in our house on Sunday nights. It was just cereal for dinner. If you don't have cereal, then you aren't having dinner. So you either had dinner growing up or you didn't. And we didn't have dinner on Sunday nights very often, a lot of times. True, because cereal is a delicious meal and it's easy to make. Because you don't have to make anything. Just pour it in the bowl. Yeah, so basically they didn't do nothing for us when it came to Sunday nights. So I'm eating the cereal now. So basically at a young age, I learned how to feed myself. It worked out. I'm still here. So as a Papa Swag, it's part of the Papa Swag technique of fathering and parenting. Is that we learn and teach our children how to be independent. We start them at an early age on how to fend for themselves and how to, you can see Ben has become a productive member of society by the Papa Swag technique of parenting. And I want you all to understand that if you're gonna be a, a father or even a mother, you need to learn to develop your children to be independent. And you can see Ben doing his little rap shaking behind me <laughs> that he's learned to fend for himself. And cereal is a key component of that fending for yourself. All you need in life is a box of cereal, milk, a bowl, and a spoon, and you'll be all right. I mean, you really don't even need the spoon. You can just drink oh, it. Oh, you can do it like this. Yeah. Oh, that's delicious. This is really good cereal. I don't find it as delicious as you as you might think I do. It's very sweet. It's sweet, but like, it's like, I don't I don't know how to explain it. It's like it's like good, but it's not great. It's not bad. It's like you know. Kind of reminds me of like uh, the Hershey Kisses kind of cereal, but I think this one might be a little bit better to me. Maybe because I'm not big on chocolate. And this one has cinnamon in it, and we're big cinnamon fans. Got brown sugar. And brown sugar. The very sweet cereal, if you like Pop Tarts, they have other flavors. They have, I think the ones that I've seen was frosted brown sugar, cinnamon, and strawberry. I'm not a big Ooh, fish. there's only one flavor. Ooh, what is that flavor? Brown sugar, cinnamon. The rest are garbage. Oh, okay. Well, I might be biased, but... Uh, they have cookies and cream. You like that that flavor? It's all right, but brown sugar cinnamon is the ultimate flavor. It's like Cheerios for you. Like, Cheerios is like the classic. Brown sugar cinnamon is the classic. 
Yeah, I don't know what the original Pop Tart flavor is, but I don't it's think brown it's brown sugar cinnamon. Okay. It's mm-hmm. gotta be. That is what I grew up knowing as the original. Because I like that. I don't like fruit. I don't like fruit either. Okay. Everybody I talk to brown sugar cinnamon is the original. Okay. You say so. It's really good in toast. You don't have to toast these this cereal. I've only toasted my Pop Tarts once in my life. And it's delicious that way. Eh, I got used to eating them without toasting them. Well, again, Papa Swag, technique of parenting. You don't always have to toast things. You can eat them without toasting. That's and true. Ben learned, he didn't even know any better. Ha 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 ha. And Sarah Nation, we'd like to hear from you. And we just have a question for you. What are some of the crazy kinds of meals you had, whether breakfast, lunch, or dinner, or snack time? Uh, I know another story of a family that had four meals a day instead of three meals a day. They had breakfast, lunch, supper, and dinner. <laughs> dinner was at 7 o'clock. Oh, yeah? Yep. That would be another story for another time. Supper was at 5, dinner was at 7. Two-hour break, that's it? That's it? I know that story, so if you have a story like that, share yeah, it. The Jay Muscle Club. must like to live there. Jay Muscle has, as I saw on an episode of The Office recently, there's first meal, lunch, second snack, then early dinner. There, there's got to be more than that. Yeah, m- yeah. So, or something like that. So, I'd like to hear about that. Um, I don't have anything else to say. Anything you would like to mention, Ben? Oh, yeah. Cereal was not the only thing I ate on Sunday nights. Don't don't think that was the only thing. I figured out a way to make some food. Cheese curls. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> Cheese curls was awesome. The only thing I did, I learned how to, I learned how to cook a little bit. All right. Well, if you enjoyed this video and you've seen some of our other videos and you haven't done so already, we would encourage you to do us a favor and hit that red button and subscribe to the channel. Also, after you hit the subscribe button, hit that bell right next to it so you're notified when we post new videos. And if you enjoyed our uh, video today and you enjoyed my uh, parenting advice, hit that like button. Do it. That's right. And uh, just remember, grab yourself a bowl. Grab yourself a spoon. Grab your favorite box of cereal. Pour the milk. And enjoy. Till the next video, I'm Papa Swag. And I'm Ben. Have a great day.